Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. But while I long to be in that number, when the saints go marching in, hymn 287. Others were advisors who possessed great foresight, 
and spoke with the power of the prophets. Some led the people through their wisdom and by their knowledge of the law of Israel, teaching the people from their wealth of understanding. Some composed great music, and others wrote great poetry. Still others possessed great wealth and power in a life of ease in their estates. All of these were known for great honor, and those among them took great pride in them. Some left behind their renown, and their stories are told in this place. Others are forgotten, passed away, as though they had never existed, as if they had never been born, and their children after them did the same. But it was different with our ancestors, who were true to their faith. Their virtuous deeds will be remembered forever. Their progeny will last for all time, and respect for their names will never die. Their bodies are at peace, but their names will never die. Hear what the Spirit is saying to the church. By the word of the United States, one Ancestors by the poet Denise Levitron. The Rob of northern white Russia declined in his youth to learn the language of birds because extraneous did not interest him. Nevertheless, when he grew old, it was found he understood them anyway, having listened well and, as it is said, prayed with the bench on the floor. He used what was at hand as the angel germs of mold, whose meditations were sewn into coats and bridges. Well, I would like to make, picking some lines still taught between me and them, poems direct as what the birds said, hard as a floor, sound as a bench, mysterious as a silence when the tailor would pause with his needle in the air. Thank you. 